Welcome to FootballGamePlan.com, where football makes sense. I'm Emory Hunt, the czar of the playbook, bring you our Division Three Game of the Week preview between the Millsaps Majors and the Mississippi College Choctaws. Now let's take a look at some keys to victory for both teams, starting with Millsaps. The Millsaps Majors are a young football team that went 7-3 and three last season, and they're breaking in a new starter at quarterback this year, so you have to worry about that passing game at the beginning of the season to find that continuity. Now defensively, when you look at two guys on that defensive line, Zach Bell and Jordan Asura, they can really get pressure on a quarterback, and that just gives the Majors, once again, a potent defensive front. Now let's move over to the Choctaws in this ballgame. You look at head coach Norman Joseph, who's entering his ninth season as the head coach and is looking to get back to his winning ways. They haven't had a winning season in the last three years. Now they must be able to find some type of consistency on offense. There's a talented receiving court led by Alex Archer. The ground game needs work as well as the offensive line. The X Factor for the Majors will be their passing game. We alluded to it earlier. Gone is outstanding quarterback Garrett Pinciotti, who put up some amazing numbers last year, 24 touchdowns, 4 interceptions. They need to find a replacement, and right now, I still have a question mark on who that's going to be entering the season. And for the Choctaws, again, we alluded to it earlier. Their offensive line is a question mark. They have to protect the quarterback better. That's something they didn't do last season. Quarterback stayed on the ground. They have to do a better job this year if they want to have some success. Now, here are some coaching points for both teams in this ball game. For Millsaps, they have to feed running back Mike Bartholomew early and often during the ball game. This is a guy that's an outstanding runner. He's a young player, but definitely has the skill sets to be one of the top Division three running backs this season. And three first downs per offensive possession. When you're struggling to find that groove offensively, you got to flip the field position and help your defense out. They can get out to the quarterback. Three first downs on the offensive side will help them do that. Now for Mississippi College, they have to stay ahead of the chains. They are struggling mightily offensively coming into the season. There's a lot of question marks, so they have to stay ahead of the chains in order to give themselves a shot. They must generate some type of pass rush defensively. You can't allow whoever's back there, quarterback for Millsaps, all day. That's something they didn't do last year. They couldn't get to the quarterback. They also couldn't protect the quarterback. So there are some legit questions going into this ballgame that they have to answer in order to come away victorious. Now here are some 2014 draft prospects you want to watch out for in this ball game. For Millsaps, defensive lineman Zach Bell at 6 feet, 220 pounds, was a SAA Defensive Player of the Year and a preseason All-American. He can really get after the quarterback. He's probably going to transition to an outside edge rusher at the next level. And we look at Mississippi College wide receiver Alex Archer, a guy that burst onto the scene last year with over 700 yards receiving and averaged 15 yards a catch. Sean Brewer is in the College Football Hall of Fame. He was a three-time All-American during his time at Millsaps from 1989 to 1992. Here's a guy that has 52 career sacks, leads that program, and one of the top pass rushers in Division III history. And Fred McAfee was an outstanding running back for Mississippi College from 1987 to 1990. He was a consensus All-American and finished his Choctaw career with over 4,400 yards rushing and 38 rushing touchdowns. I like the Millsaps Majors coming in and winning the backyard brawl once again. This is an outstanding rivalry in college football. But when I look at the Majors on offense, I think they'll be able to run the football with Bartholomew. You saw him right there. And right now, you have to like their defensive line going against that Choctaw offensive front. Look for the Majors to come away victorious versus their hated rivals, the Mississippi College Choctaws, in which should be a thrilling game nonetheless.